Kite Smith was the track and cross country coach at Freedom High School. And ABC Action News reporter Clifton French has been digging into the investigation. So, Cliff, you learned this was actually going on for weeks, right? Yeah, several weeks. According to investigators, this was not a one time thing. Uh, they say it started while the team was on a trip uh, to Gainesville and it lasted for some time. Disgusted. Parents react as they hear the news. For some, anger. Others, shock. I'm getting real surprised about it because I'm just enrolling her. A once respected coach and classroom assistant now in jail. Police saying he had sex with a 17 year old girl at least three times. Crimes spanning through multiple counties. According to investigators, the relationship started in September while at a meet in Gainesville. 47 year old Dwight Smith gave one of his 17 year old athletes alcohol and the key to his hotel room. Police said he had sex with the girl twice there. The very next week, on another trip in Titusville, nearly the same scenario. And in Tampa, he went to the girl's home where there was inappropriate touching in her driveway. That was weeks after the first encounter. Tampa police tell me that investigation started two and a half weeks ago when that student came forward with those disturbing details. Initially giving a statement to the school resource officer, the student says she was never forced into having sex, but finally realized that relationship was inappropriate. Where is this world going? I mean, what, what kind of school system is this? Now, school officials tell us that Smith uh, had been a coach here and also uh, somewhat of a classroom assistant since 2009. He was fired back on November 12th. That is when this investigation began. I'm reporting live in Tampa, Clifton French, ABC Action News.